it literally says, hey, log writer, please. Redo generation. Of course, my connected application sessions will generate Redo. They're going to do updates and deletes and inserts, etc. But I see Redo generation coming out of the DB writer process. Why would DB writer generate Redo? So if this is the first you've seen of this diagram, um, I'll put a video link in the description showing you how we came across the concept of private redo. We need to know that we have private versus public redo in modern versions of Oracle. What happens is sessions write to private redo and then the private redo will be flushed to the log buffer, the public log buffer, and then the log writer will take care of flushing that down to the database. Now in the good old days when we didn't have private redo, all the sessions would write to the log buffer and then some, occasionally the database writer needs to do things like a checkpoint. And it needs to make sure that all those log information is flushed out. So it literally says, hey, log writer, please flush out the redo. I need to do a checkpoint. That's an easy request for the DB writer to do because it simply posts the log writer, sends it, yeah, literally sends it a message saying, hey, do your job. I need to do a checkpoint. Let me know when you're done. That works because the only place redo information is, is in the log buffer. In modern versions of Oracle, well, we have stuff in the log buffer, but we also have sessions with their own private redo inside their own private redo log buffers. Now when DB writer says, look, I need to actually uh, do a checkpoint. I need to make sure the redo log is flushed. It now has the job of going and getting all that private redo information from each of the sessions that are using it, making sure it's dragged down into the log buffer and then tells log buffer, hey, flush that stuff out. Now you get an interesting statistical anomaly here. The act of DB Writer getting information out of those private redo buffers and dragging them into the public log buffer so Log Writer can dump them out to disk, that is actually called redo for DB Writer. It actually contributes to the redo size statistic for DB Writer. And in fact, if I log on to my database and ran, I ran this query before Office Hours started, you can see that for the program called DBW Anything, for redo size, this database has done, what do we got? 15 megabytes of redo. DB Writer hasn't actually written out to the, to the redo logs. What it's done is 15 megabytes over the life of the instance of having to go drag information out of private redo buffers, put it into the public log buffer such that Log Writer can do its job so DB Writer can continue on and do what it needs, for example, a checkpoint, et cetera. <laughs>